Washington now, where the government is up and running again. Both President Obama and top Republicans are vowing it won't shut down again. But at least one Tea Party favorite is promising to keep the fight going. Senator Ted Cruz sat down with our Jonathan Carl. And John, a lot of defiance there. That's for sure, George. Ted Cruz says the biggest problem in all this is that Republicans were divided and that they backed down too easily. So you would do it again? I would do anything, and I will continue to do anything I can, to stop the train wreck that is Obamacare. Will you rule out pushing to the brink of another shutdown? John, I know you Or will want, you say you're I, not going to do that John, again? I know you want to nail down all sorts of future tactical decisions. What I intend to do is continue standing with the American people to work to stop Obamacare because it isn't working, it's costing people's jobs, and it's taking away their health care. People hated this shutdown, they hated this impasse, and this was seen as the Ted Cruz shutdown. You, more than any single individual, were seen as the one that triggered this crisis to begin with. John, I agree that a lot of D.C. politicians tried to call well, it talking, that, and, and a lot of the media did, too. But talking about public opinion nationally. Uh, well, look, I, let me be very clear. I said throughout this, we shouldn't have a shutdown. I don't want a shutdown. I repeatedly voted to but open the government. there never would have been a shutdown if you hadn't gone with this strategy of saying, we're not even going to fund the government for six weeks and, and you know unless what? we can defund and, and Obamacare. And you know what, John? There never would have been a shutdown if Harry Reid and President Obama hadn't said, we will not compromise, we will not negotiate, shut the government down. Now, Democratic and Republican leaders in Congress, like the president, are saying emphatically, George, that there will not be another shutdown. That's what they are promising right now, though we saw the fight right there. Meantime, there are some calmer voices starting to get together right away to see if they can put together some kind of small-scale budget deal before the end of the year. Yeah, very important and very significant meeting over breakfast Thursday between Paul Ryan, the top Republican on budget matters, and Patty Murray, the top Democrat. They are trying to get together. This would not be a big deal, George, but this would be something to ensure that when the money runs out again on January 15th, they've got another agreement in place to fund the government for the rest of the year. Government stays open, debt limit extended. Let's hope that happens. John Carl, thanks very much. Sunday on this week, a lot more from Ted Cruz, plus exclusive interviews with Jeb Bush and Nancy Pelosi.